So we're getting an RV today. So it's funny how things work out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so life is always full of crazy changes and we are now taking a new friend on the trip. Care to explain? Well, I'm a pet sitter and um, one of the dogs that I take care of, her mom went to work in a different state for three months and uh, she left Emma with us. So, Emma! Emma! <laughs> She's like, what, what, Wait, me, me, this is Emma. <laughs> and she is coming along for the ride with us. She's Hooray. gonna join Shayla and Sasha. Shayla and Sasha. For the little ride that we're gonna be going on. So, we're up for an adventure. On top of that, we also were able to, <laughs> I see you, I see you, I see you, yes. We were able to uh, secure a much better loan on the, uh, on the RV, so have a little bit of extra funds to... Uh... Cut, cut, nope, no good, nope, that's not what we're trying to do here. Have a new idea. So originally we had the idea of clicking into show you this new camera that we just got. But I think what we want to do now and what we decided about that same time in the video is that we're going to provide what we call couch commentary. Today we're going to sell my Subaru Crosstrek so that we can get the down payment for the RV. We are getting rid of our two cars here that are beeping in the background <laughs> because we just got this guy. <laughs> we are going in. Now we got a tow vehicle that will actually get towed by the RV. Yes. That's we'll the explain a little bit more later. This was a crazy, crazy experience. So it's funny how things work out, isn't it? <laughs> I think that's going to be a common theme of this. We ended up right before I left for the car dealership, I was running some numbers and I was thinking about the fact that the Subaru would need a flat tow uh, trailer to tow the Subaru if we ever wanted to go anywhere. So we were like, well, why don't we look into looking at a new car that can be towed behind the RV? And that's what led us to selling both of the cars. The uh, idea, I think, came like five minutes before right we before we walked out the door i was like <laughs> let's let's just go to the somewhere else and then she suggested the jeep dealership and that's why we ended up with the jeep we are at funtime rv pulling up to see our rv our new baby well our second new baby second new baby <laughs> purchased and there it is. 2018 Winnebago. Winnebago. Mini Winnie 31K. It's got a slide out on this side that slides out the whole living area. Yeah, so we're gonna just, why not go in? So this is it without the slides out. So you have the bed up there. So you can tell right there that it would actually double the space right there. And that is the RV. You know, I always knew that you were crazy, but I never thought you would do something like that. You're crazy. I am crazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. What have I done? I apparently have purchased an RV. Oh my god. Um, so I guess I need to get out of the thing to adjust these mirrors. Duh! Of course you have to get out of the thing! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Crazy. Um, everything happened so fast. 
it was crazy from the minute that they told us we needed five figures to put down on the RV to the new deal that we worked on the RV to the getting the RV to one week later going and picking it up to not even test driving this thing and getting in it and driving off in a brand new vehicle that I have never even driven before in my entire life. Uh, another thing that was kind of disappointing when we bought this was the fact that I was miscommunicated and they told me that I was going to be getting one or I was going to be getting the one with 25,000 miles on it and I ended up with the one with 36,000 miles on it which a little disappointing because that's 10,000 extra miles on a 2018 um, but all in all everything's good we were looked that everything was good because you know like you said everything happened so fast and we didn't do like the normal things that we were supposed to do but anyway it worked out we have a we have the RV and then came the Amazon packages yes. all the accessories that we needed to order for this thing yeah Look, looked like Christmas every single day a new package new package you new know. package it was great and then there was one thing that I would think of and then another thing that I would think of and then one thing that I'd have to return to go get another thing and I know it was well crazy. The, the terrible part was like when comes something from Amazon, you think, oh my God, it's something extraordinary and it was toilet paper. <laughs> or sitting here next to my poop tank. Don't worry. It's brand new, thankfully. I don't think that was necessary. <laughs> <laughs> it just happens. <laughs> Welcome to me. <laughs> Letting the animals take a gander at this whole new experience that we have here. Let's Shayla and Sasha down. There they are. And we're really just, just chilling. Sitting here inside of the RV in the driveway. Just getting an experience for it. You know, the animals, I, I didn't think the animals will react to this way. But yeah, they seem to be taking it really well. Yeah. They're enjoying being outside, but inside still. Exploring, which it was good, I think. No doubt. Lots of space. Very comfortable. Very, very chill in here. <laughs> and there's the guppies. Well, overall, everything was fine. Yeah, it was actually, it was a good experience. We got everything going and now we're ready to start our next adventure, going to stay up at our friend's house in Camas, Washington. Yes, and we'll see how everything will go, but I'm excited. Yep, stay tuned till next week. Bye.